as dialed. Hey Stacy, good morning. I'm sorry, did I did I wake you? I'm sorry, it's Sam Maglieri. How are you? Well, um, last time you bailed me out of jail, it was a one hundred thousand dollar bond, and those charges were non-compliant, violating a court order in the first degree, based on a misdemeanor. That's a that's a false arrest, non-compliant charge, and a hundred thousand dollar unconstitutional bail fee. The judge in the judge in Bridgeport said he forfeited my bond, that hundred thousand dollars plus the other bonds too that we put up. Well, I, I want to get the money back. They robbed me. That's extortion. False arrest, unconstitutional bail fees, and theft. Larceny, conspiracy. And this is good. It'll dismiss my charges once I once this goes public. They lied about everything, Stacy. You know that. You need to help me, man. Your wife is involved, too. I need her name. I, I need to... Uh, I'm going to go to her for freedom of information through the city. They're all conspiring. I'm sorry? I need my money back. You you didn't do it? I notified you. I notified you over a year ago. What? The state keeps arresting me. They don't let me say anything. They They broke... They put me in jail again. And you robbed me, Stacy. You, you made like seven thousand dollars on that, and it was non-compliant. You're supposed to know that. I need your wife's name because I'm going to petition her under Freedom of Information. She's an accountant with the with the city. You're all you're all liable, and you're complicit, Stacy. Did you hang up on me? Complicit bail bondsman, Stacy DeCausey. Stacy DeCausey, bail bondsman, complicit participant in whistleblower retaliation crimes with Stanford Police and Judge Bruce Hudock. Michael Fideli, police commissioner, Dory Jackson, and all the police commissioners. Felony, false arrest, non-compliant, violating a court order in the first degree based on a misdemeanor. Felony, false arrest, unconstitutional bail fees, extortion, conspiracy, whistleblower, retaliation, violations of Connecticut General Statutes 4-61 double D. Prohibited action against a whistleblower with the Board of Ethics Concealing evidence and videos of the Board of Ethics is felony evidence tampering conspiracy with Stacey DeCausey, city and state governments, Board of Ethics, concealing videos to conceal the racketeering, fraud, conspiracy, violating election procedures, election fraud, April 17, 2019, and conspiracy false arrest on video with the Board of Ethics 
May 15, 2019. Conspiracy crimes of Stacy DeCossi, the bail bondsman, his wife, who's an accountant with the city, city of Stanford government, and the state of Connecticut. Over 16 superior court judges illegally incarcerated an innocent man to conceal the crimes of Stacy DeCossi and the city of Stanford and the state of Connecticut. November 26, 2023. I am the whistleblower.